Hello everyone, this is Aizen and Danen from My Cigar Blog and uh, the month of Ramadan is over and that means it's time to smoke some cigars. Um, it's a holiday here for the last couple of days in Malaysia to celebrate uh, uh, the end of the fasting month. We call it Hari Raya in Malaysia and it's a public holiday for a couple of days. So um, I go back to work tomorrow and uh, I thought that I would have something special today uh, just to be able to post a good review and come back slowly uh, and uh, start doing more reviews for everyone and of course ease back into the full of smoking cigars uh, after not smoking for about a month you know it those of you who have taken breaks from smoking cigars it takes one or two sticks to come back into the fold if you know what I mean and uh, because the palates have changed, and of course, you know, during the fasting month, uh, we're not allowed to drink or eat during daytime. So obviously, you know, uh, how we taste things will be different. So coming back to it, um, I've got a nice stick today. Something a little bit different from what uh, from what I've reviewed before. And uh, what I have is a Punch 2009 Platino, which is a uh, Exclusivo India. Um, it's a regional edition made for India. It's a double Corona, uh, and it's really nice because it comes in wonderful silver foil packaging. Uh, hence the name, the Platino. Uh, received this cigar quite a number of months back. Uh, I think almost a year now. So it's been sitting in the humidor for for just the right occasion, and I think I found it today. Uh, all right, let's let's see what it looks like. The slide this baby off. Pull it right off. Ah, oh, there we go. Now uh, this, to me, this is how a cigar should look like. Uh, no fancy bands, you know. Just a piece of well-rolled tobacco. Mmm, glorious. Very sweet. Ooh, very sweet and fresh aroma. Mmm. Yep, this is going to be interesting. Alright, I'm going to cut into this and get back to you guys uh, with my first impressions in just a few moments. Hang on. Alright, cut the top off, the cap off. Mm. Very dry, hay flavored, cold. Draw is just nice. A little bit firm, but that's alright considering it's, it is a double Corona. All right, let's light this baby up and see where it takes us. Um, made in 2009, the Platino were uh, total number of boxes, 1,600 boxes, and that's it. So, exclusive for in there. Uh, boxes are 25, obviously. Didn't know the Indians preferred double Coronas. Um, of course, you guys know that, uh, that the regional editions are made according to specifications by the distributors of that region. So, mm. Mm. wow, Ooh. Really nice, right off the bat. A lot of honeyed sweetness. It's very floral. First couple of drawers, very easy, non spicy. Flowery smoke. A little bit of just a bit of sweet bitterness. And I'm really liking the draw. Firm stick. Quite rare nowadays in the in regular production Cuban cigars. 
but firm, firm to the touch, and just nice to the draw. All right, I'm going to enjoy this through the first third and get back to you guys with my first impressions. Hang on. Hmm. Hmm. Smoke through the first third of this uh, Punch Platino. And it's it's a good cigar. I would say that for that that for it, it's a good cigar. It's a, it's maybe medium light, medium light, um, quite a mild cigar as far as flavor and punch are, cons are concerned. But it's got a lot of very tangy floral flavors. With a rich undertone of rich undertone of some bitter chocolate which is a uh, quite a delightful combination one of those really easy going cigars that uh, that doesn't take much effort to smoke but allows you to enjoy the flavors the light flavors and the floral aroma quite nicely um, despite its size it's a double corona the cigar would go quite well as a late morning smoke perhaps um, or if you just wanted to have something in your mouth as you as you start the day off, even as a morning smoke, if you have the time, I rarely say this about double coronas, but this one, this one would fit the bill. Mm. Good smoke volume, luxuriously firm draw. Nice, very nice. I'm right, gonna smoke it past a halfway mark and come back with a. Uh, more impressions in just a minute. You know, with a with a great cigar, time just seems to pass really quick, and so it is with this cigar. It's been about an hour since I started, and then past the halfway mark, and uh, wow, it's really nice. It's really opening up the flavors, still maintaining medium to light and composure, but uh, detecting a lot of vanilla notes, a lot of vanilla and the. Uh, Hun musky honey is really picking up some. It's a uh, although it's a mild dish cigar, not not super mild, not like a quid or say, but uh, quite mild for a punch. I would say uh, it is able to provide quite a bit of complexity, which I like. Hmm. Each draw is like scooping to a, it's like taking a big scoop of a, a rich vanilla ice cream almost. Um, the chocolate bitterness from earlier is gone. The sweet bitterness from earlier is gone. It's just really smooth, really sweet now. It's a, if there was ever a need to be able to describe what a sweet cigar would be like, um, this would be it, the Punch Platino. All right, I'm gonna smoke it right down to the nub and uh, come back with you my final impressions. Into the final third of the Punch Platino, and uh, it's it's a really good cigar. As you can see, the burn is perfect. I haven't had to touch up even once during this uh, since the last two hours or so. And uh, Just becoming a little bit more full body towards the end here. Mm, not much tar build up. Can't really see it in the video, but it's still quite clear at the, at the, at the foot. Where normally by now for a double corona it would be pretty dark with tar. So definitely no bitterness whatsoever in this cigar. And uh, to me that's that's a great sign. Um, cigar that maintains its composure throughout for a double corona. Smooth sweet honey vanilla notes maybe some toasted butter and of course that nice little chocolate bitterness in the beginning which has disappeared completely now has made this guy a really wonderful overall experience uh, not to mention the gorgeous rich aroma mm. and the perfection of the construction that leads to such a wonderful draw and good smoke volume. I would say I'm very lucky that my comeback cigar after the fasting month Ramadan was the Punch Platino. 
Uh, it's been excellent, an excellent experience. Probably about two hours, fifteen minutes, two hours, thirty minutes smoking time once I finish with it. Uh, but if you can still get, you can probably still get your hands on these if you look hard enough. Um, they had regional edition for India. Ask around, um, especially if you if you normally buy from places like the Middle East or even in from Hong Kong, you probably can get still get your hands on some of these. All right, I'm Izun and Danan, and I'm signing off for my cigar blog. Smoke well, long ashes, and see you guys next time. Take care.